Hi, I'm Michael from Cherry. We are here at the CES show in Las Vegas to introduce our newest product, the Cherry Viola Switch. So we as Cherry see the market in two segments. The high-end segment above $100 and the value segment below $100. And in the value segment, they're coming up technologies like hybrid mechanical or memchanical. And these technologies are not really mechanical technologies. It's a rubber term technology based. Therefore, we now introduce our Cherry Viola switch and it's Cherry's first fully mechanical solution for the value market. And for all the technical details about that new switch, I've brought Van der Keck with me and he's our director of engineering and explaining us all the technical details. As Michael already mentioned, um, the Viola was especially designed for the value market and therefore we had to design the switch very easy, very simple. What does that mean? This uh, switch, which is a really true mechanical switch, only consists of four parts compared to eight parts uh, on our standard switches. This switch consists of um, two plastic parts, a housing, a stem, and two metal parts, a compression spring, and a contact system out of bronze material, which is very unique. It's a V-shaped contact plate, which is the heart of the switch. This uh, V-shaped contact plate leads to a very unique uh, switch characteristic that means we have a two-stage actuation, two linear curves, uh, which gives um, the end user the benefit of a very ergonomic actuation and a very fast reset. Talking about the switch parameter, we'll have a pre-travel of two millimeters and an over-travel of two millimeters, which leads to a total travel of four millimeters. Um, the operating force is 45 centinewton and the force in the end position is 75 centinewton. So this end force of 75 centinewton leads to a very fast reset. A very nice feature of the Viola switch is that the switch is hot swap. This means you can easily change the switches. We will start with the linear uh, viola switch and different uh, versions will follow, like the click one, like a tactile one. Um, this gives uh, the end user the um, benefit that they can really customize their keyboards. In addition to that, um, viola supports RGB lightning and we use the cross stem design on our plunger which gives the customer the chance to reuse their keycaps. So although the switch looks very easy, it was very difficult to, to develop it. So the total development process took us more than one and a half year to get the final product. All the switches um, are produced and also Viola is produced in Germany in our new headquarter in Auerbach. So with the CES launch, of course, we briefed the international press in our suite and we asked them about their feedback of our newest Cherry Viola switch. Yeah, I was playing around with the uh, uh, Viola switches uh, here in the Cherry suite on CES. Uh, I, I love the product. It's uh, uh, targeting a very interesting market. Uh, we see a lot of uh, keyboards out there with rubber dome uh, and now they can use the cherry switches and have a much better quality. So for me, I really like it um, and it's there's not a lot of movement. When you're typing just normal home row and then moving over to tin key, it's not a lot of extra movement. Whereas some keys, when you're typing, they will wobble a little bit, it moves, it flexes. I don't like that. And so with this, I didn't notice any flex or any extra movement. I'm hoping that this will be significantly under $100 US and that I think it's going to have a huge market potential because it feels really, really good. I love the soft feel, but still you get the feedback of mechanical uh, and the added features of this, you know, the, the replaceable switches and you get the, the RGB in. It's going to be very competitive, but I, I hope it's way below $100 so you can really knock out a lot of those membrane keyboards that really aren't worth buying for gaming. It's been hard for me to recommend something between 50 and 100, just, there just wasn't anything there that was, was worth buying. So I really like it. 
I got to try these uh, uh, the new switches and so far uh, they seem to perform great. It gets a little getting used to, but uh, the overall feeling is great. Uh, the travel distance feels, feels just the same as uh, the traditional Cherry MX switches. And, uh, and so far the overall experience is quite nice. And uh, I'm, I'll be welcoming uh, products of other uh, price points uh, using these switches, definitely. Typing on this is kind of amazing on there. It feels, doesn't feel like a rubber dome at all. Um, and I feel really confident that I can hit my keys and I also can feel the responsiveness with all of the keys as I'm typing. So I'm here at Cherry and I test the new Cherry uh, Viola switches and they have a really nice feeling. So the actuation point fits really nice and they're not wobbly at all. Um, I think they are supposed to be for uh, the lower priced keyboard market for gamers who maybe don't have that much money or they don't want to spend over 100 euros. So I'm really excited to test them out when they come out later this year. So as you can see, the press is very excited about our product. Unfortunately, it will take a few months until you can get it in your hands. So we're expecting the first keyboards launching in the second half of this year. So stay excited and thank you for watching. Dankeschön.